Come in, Chris. Sorry, we're a little late. Oh, didn't even notice. How long have I got little Sammy for today? Just until four, if that's OK. You ready to continue your training then, Sammy? Growing up, you learn a lot. Like what, Grandad? Oh, you find, for some people, they lose their imagination. You haven't forgotten, Grandad, and you're quite old. <laughs> yes, I am quite old. But why would you want to forget? It isn't the case of wanting to forget. It's the way, after childhood, the meaning changes. I'm glad we can do this together, Grandad. Oh, me too. Remember the first time I flew above those clouds up there? They look so far away, don't they? They are far away. Oh, but when you get up close to them, when you make the break and appear above them, they appear like mountains in the sky. And since then, I understand clouds to be an earth above the earth. Just think for a moment that if people lived above those clouds, I wish I could live up there. Oh, me too. Dad says clouds just make rain. You couldn't live up there. Oh, yeah, that is what they do. But imagination allows us to make new meanings. Which reminds me, we need to get going. Where are we going? Oh, to a place built by imagination. Oh, hold on. Hi, Dad. Thanks for having her again. No. Oh, that's OK. Dad, has it come back? Hmm? Look, if you want me to book something. No, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. It's, it's OK. I, I just want to spend some time with, with little Sammy. Do you want to go to the fields today, Sammy? There's a big lesson ahead. Yes, please, Grandad. See you later, Dad. Take care, both of you. Something I've been working on recently. It shows how we humans are related.
to plant. Why have you made it? It's a way of understanding life, and I want to pass it on to you. Each plant changes as it grows. Roots will grow further into the ground, but shoots grow upward to find light. So roots are like normal people, and shoots are like astronauts? Yeah, that's very good. Excellent, Sammy. Those shoots, by growing stems, they let their seeds blow in the wind and inspire other people, spreading their ideas. I think I get it. And then, in the end, everything must wilt. Do you want to know the best form of imagination? Yes, please. Well, after many years of being alive, I've decided to use imagination as recreation. Sorry, Grandad, but what's recreation? That's when you lose something. And, and you want it to be real again. Did you really used to fly planes, Grandad? I still do. Wow. Can I get you anything, Dad? Oh, a cup of tea. And uh, one of those awful tablets in the third drawer down by the fridge. Sure. I'll be right back. OK. Let's go and sit on the bed, shall we? You said you still fly planes, Grandad. Is that true? Oh, getting old has taught me one thing, Sammy. If you can't live out there, then you have to live in here. It's called Ampicillin. You know, music is imagination's greatest friend. Like me and you? Yeah, like me and you, Sammy. <laughs> now, I'll run downstairs and help your dad with the tea. Granddad. I won't forget. Sammy? Just a moment. Thank you. 